Welcome! I am going to take you on a little adventure. We are going to go from the North Pole to New York City in probably just under about 30 minutes. So this is what I will call a big picture video designed to show you how all this online business, how building a product and all that kind of fits together so that as we're going through each of the individual trainings, you will have a bucket to put that information. So first off, I want you to think about the North Pole and some words that might be popping into your head as I write it on the board. So we have, not only, I know I have more space, so we're gonna go over here. We have the North Pole. Now, when you heard North Pole, did you think cold and snow, maybe Santa Claus? All good words because North Pole is cold. In our world, it represents cold traffic. So cold traffic means people don't know who you are. They have really no exposure to you. They don't know what you do. They don't know what um, you're talking about. They just stumble across you in some way out in the world, online or offline. I also like to use North Pole because since they don't know you, they are a new person, okay? So North Pole, nor new person, cold traffic. Now, at the other end of the spectrum, we have New York City. And what are some words that you might think about with New York City? Restaurants, hotels, banking, big, you know, uh, skylines and shopping and Broadway and theaters. Well, there, people are always spending money, okay? So New York City for us, for the purposes of this um, journey that I'm taking you on, New York City is money. This is where people are buying what you are selling, okay? So we need to get people from the North Pole, where they're quite chilly and they have no idea who you are, over to New York City, where they are excited and they're happy and they're having a good time and they're spending their money buying your products. So how do we do this? Now, what I like to tell people is think about if I said to you, hey, I want you to get from the North Pole to New York City in six months. Well, you could take quite a journey. You could drive through, and we're using North Pole, Alaska. I should clarify that. We use North Pole, Alaska. It actually was my hometown when I was an Alaskan state resident. My address was 3526 Go That Away Drive, North Pole, Alaska. So it's totally real and completely legit. Uh, when I was born, it was 65 degrees below zero in January. So um, very, very cold place. But North Pole, Alaska to New York City. And you can follow along if you want to, pop it into Google Maps. But if I said, hey, you have six months to get from here to here, you could go and sightsee and, you know, maybe fly a part of it, maybe drive a part of it, maybe take a train. You could leisurely go throughout your way and you could meander all over the place. Contrast that with you need to get from North Pole to New York City by 8 a.m. tomorrow morning. Your options are pretty slim. Okay, you really have one option. Find, find an airport, find a flight, get on it so that you could make it happen. That's what we're going to do. As we're going through um, this process, as we're doing it, we want to just take a direct route. We don't want to wander around for six months because wandering while enjoyable is not the quickest way to get your content out there, to get yourself out there, and to be making money doing so. So under the um, North Pole, okay, over here, this is where people start their journey. And we're going to call them read magnets. Okay, just stick me stick with me. I'm going to teach you all the lingo. Don't worry. After a read magnet, you have what's called a lead. Okay, and it's a lead magnet. And then in right here, you have what's called a mini course. And then here you have 
courses, you have services, you can have events. That's where things, that's how they play out. So a read magnet and a lead magnet, think about what a magnet's purpose is. Ideally, it's to attract two things two together. Uh, my oldest would say, oh, but if you flip them over, they repel. They absolutely do. But think of it as attracting people to you. So a read magnet is something like a live stream or a blog article, a YouTube playlist, a video that they see on social media. That is a lead, that's a read magnet. A podcast would be a read magnet, something where people are engaging with you, okay? You're drawing them to you by reading. Now it's a very broad definition of read because it could be video or audio in addition to just being text uh, that it was historically, but you're drawing them to you. Well, when they're reading here, they're just a visitor, okay? They are a total visitor. They haven't established a communication pathway with you just yet. And a communication pathway is done in the form of, think of your, you know, email. I can email you directly. That's a direct communication pathway. Also, we now have the ability to use messenger bots through Facebook Messenger. I can send you a message straight through Facebook Messenger. So a communication pathway does not exist for visitors, okay? They're just visiting. They can leave. You have no way, like, yeah, there's no tethers. There's nothing connecting you to them. Well, that changes when you create a lead magnet. So a lead magnet is a stronger, okay, a bigger magnet. This might be a, this a teeny little magnet. Here's a much bigger magnet, okay, has more power. This is, you may have heard people say an ethical bribe, um, which I still can't say I totally understand that vernacular, but you're giving someone something in exchange for them giving you access to one of their communication pathways. Email, Facebook Messenger, it could also be a phone number or a mailing address, but we're going to leave those to the side because most of us are not bricks and mortar and most people are not using that at all anymore. So yes, those exist, but we're not talking about them. The lead magnet, think about when you're shopping. Okay, you're shopping online, you go to your favorite website, and it says, uh, enter your email to get 10% off. The lead magnet. That's a coupon lead magnet, but that's a total lead magnet. You might have also signed up for other things. You know, you wanted to learn how to garden, and so you came across a gardening blog, and the person said, hey, enter your email and get my uh, the 10 easiest vegetables to grow organically guide. You entered your email, they sent it to you. That's a lead magnet. What you're there doing is you're creating content or an offer, a coupon would be an offer, and then saying, hey, I will give you this if you let us start establish a communication pathway, email address or messenger bots. And we will be talking about both because um, messenger bots are just, <laughs> I'm in love, I'm absolutely in love. But this lead magnet, now my visitor is really a subscriber, okay? Because I have established a communication pathway with them, which is what you want to do because you're building up your audience. You're creating these um, communication, communication pathways. You'll also hear it referred to as list building. It is exactly what people have been doing for as long as business has been in existence, you're building up your Rolodex. You're building up relationships and conversations with people so that they can know what you do, how you can help them and purchase you know, your products and learn from you. So once they're a subscriber, you know, then their next step is to become a customer. And this is where your mini course can come into play. The mini course is a small, very low risk investment on the part of the customer where they can try out what you have to offer. I have lots of things that cost $10,000 and more. Someone that just met me is not gonna sign up for that. That's way over here. You know, there we go. We have, you know, big time offers over there. 
they're not going to go here. You know, just think about you in real life. If you just meet a company, you're not writing like a massive check to them. You're not handing over your credit card. I hope not. So this mini course, this is your low, low investment. Okay. And this could be anything. It really could. And we're going to, as I walk you through, I'm going to show you why I reverse engineer everything. Okay, we're walking through it from beginning to end, but as I am teaching it to you, we are going to start, we're going to go the reverse engineering process. Okay, we're going to say, hey, I want this to happen and work, our, and work ourselves backward. But a mini course is you creating something, for most people, this is going to be under $50. So what I say is 20 people, $50 gets you Kajabi Hero status. Totally doable. Very... Um, it just doable. It's absolutely doable and achievable. I've witnessed it hundreds of times. It's cool. So here you're going, you know, something less than 50. Okay. Which I think it's, I think it's, oh goodness, I don't remember my greater than less than skills, but that's your low mini course. Then you have other stuff that you're going to make. Okay, you're, you're going to make lots of different products or services. You may have a signature product that you offer. You may have a membership. It can be any number of things. You may, you may be a, um, someone that's in direct selling and um, network marketing. This same thing can work for you. So this, um, the mini course, leads into full courses. All right. So that's our big picture. That's how we move people from being in the North Pole, cold, knowing nothing about you, to learning about you by reading or listening or watching something, then becoming a subscriber. So you providing something of value to them in exchange for them allowing you to establish a communication pathway, email and or messenger bots. The mini course, which is a low investment for them, but lets them get a taste of what you create. Lets you make a smaller product where, you know, I could make a very small product. How to organize your kid's nightmarish playroom in one day for less than $100. So that would be a great idea for a mini course. It's short, it's sweet, they can finish it and feel like, wow, I really got the value of that. And then this leads them into saying, hey, I wonder what else that this person has available that I could purchase. If that, that's the journey, New York, North Pole to New York City. Now, as we're going through these trainings, we're going to map out your pathway, your journey in terms of saying, okay, what are the products that you want to sell? Great. What is a mini course that compliments that make sense for what you're doing because we're we're leading people and this is where the reverse engineering comes into play is we start here uh, we'll just go here we start here at new york all right we start here at new york and then we work backwards and we say okay what makes sense for a mini course what is something that complements and becomes a natural like, oh yeah, that made total sense. I would like to, you know, move in and get that other next product. From the mini course, you back it up and you say, okay, well, what's a lead magnet that would make sense to the customer? Because remember, they're going forwards. We're creating from the backwards end. And then from the lead magnet, we work and we say, okay, what's a good lead magnet, a read magnet? What could I create? And we're creating and mapping all of this out so that it stays cohesive, so that it stays easy, it isn't frustrating, and you are able to enjoy the ride that you're creating, you know, the ride that you're going on. If you have any questions at this point, please feel free to use the comments below. Leave me a comment. Um, the cool thing is, is we can all have a really fun, robust discussion. And also, if you're in Team PPK, you are more than welcome to post it in that group. You can also post it in the official Kajabi group. So 
never ever, we are not on, you know, isolated solo rides here. <laughs> there is plenty of help for you for questions or ideas, brainstorming, whatever you have you. So I hope you enjoyed going from New York to New York City, and I will see you again really soon. Bye for now.